Hello, this is Walker Physics, 4th edition, and we're in Chapter 7 on Work and Kinetic Energy, and this is question number 13 from the end of the chapter. To clean a floor, a janitor pushes a mop, with a, a mop handle with a force of 50 newtons. If the mop handle is at an angle of 55 above the horizontal, how much work is required to push the mop a half a meter? All right, I guess I have to what? I have to draw a mop. So a mop looks like that, right? And he's shoving into it with 50 newtons. And the angle that it makes with the ground is 55. So if it is going to cross 50, uh, 0.5 meters, then it's only the it's only the direction this direction. The force is at an angle, but we're only look, wanting the horizontal uh, force because work is done through a force or through a distance. It's the amount of force put through a distance. So when you when you say that it is uh, W or work equals force times distance, we're only wanting the force that goes through the distance. So part of this 50 newtons is going into the floor and that's wasted. Some of it is going forward and it's that forward part of the force. So I need some trig and we see that this is going to be 50 newtons times the sine of 55 degrees. And this is 50 newtons times the cosine of 55 degrees. And that is the force that we're going to put here. So work is going, work is going to be equal to 50 times the cosine of 55 degrees times a half a meter. So when we do that, we get work equals 14 point three five joules. Well, we've got this is two significant figures, so we want work equals 14 joules. So that's A. The B part says if the angle of the mop handle makes with the horizontal is increased to 65. Does the work done by the janitor increase, decrease, or stay the same? Well, I'd love to ask you that question. If, if I am shoving more into the floor, is the part that I'm shoving forward higher or lower? Well, it would be lower, right? Like, as this goes higher... More of the for more of that force, 50 newtons or whatever force, is being shoved into the floor, which is just being resisted by the floor. Less of that force is being directed forward. Imagine uh, shoving down straight down on a mop at 90 degrees, where it's not moving at all. It's just you're just shoving down into the ground, and the ground's pushing back up. So the higher it gets, the less forward force that you have, which means the less work you're doing. Okay, so B is going to be less. Explain, okay, well, the cosine of 65 is going to be less than the cosine of 55. Okay, it makes sense to me, make I'm sure it happens. So, cosine of 55 is 0.57, cosine of 65 is 0.42. So as it goes towards 90, you're getting less and less and less and less and less. Okay, great, thanks.